As the capital of Malaysia, Kuala Lumpur is an exciting place to explore. This is Katie from Creative Travel Guide and today we share the things to know before you go to Kuala Lumpur. Looking for more travel tips? Make sure to hit subscribe and ring that notification bell. So let's look at the best time to visit. Kuala Lumpur can be visited all year round as the weather is warm and consistent. December to January and June to August are more popular times to visit because of the festivals during these times. February, March, September and October are known as the off season and prices can be slightly cheaper at this time. So now let's look at getting there. There are a few different ways to get to the capital of Malaysia. Most visitors will head to the city via air, landing at the Kuala Lumpur International Airport. This is a modern airport rated as one of the world's top airports. Surrounded by other Southeast Asian destinations, it is also common for travelers to visit via rail. The KTM railway service connects the city to other cities in Malaysia, whilst in international trains are available from Singapore and Thailand. So now let's look at getting around. Walking in Kuala Lumpur is a popular option in the city. Many of the major sites can be walked between. There are some popular walking routes around neighborhoods like Chinatown. We will leave the links in the description below. There are plenty of train routes available in the city with commuter trains connecting you to the airport and destinations outside of the city center. A great option for those short on time is to use the hop on hop off bus to get around to the major sites in the city. So now let's look at the typical prices. Hostel dorm beds start at around 40 ringgit and private budget rooms begin at around 80. Mid-range hotels in good locations begin at around 800 whilst more luxurious hotels in the city centre start at around 2000 Malaysian ringgit. A simple breakfast or lunch can be found for around 10 whilst mid-range sit-down meals begin at 50. Malaysia is a fairly affordable place to explore, especially for those on a budget. As with most Southeast Asian destinations, eating like a local and sticking to street vendors will help you save money on food. Take the train or bus instead of using the taxis and there are plenty of free attractions to explore as well. You could also choose to visit free or budget-friendly attractions like the National Art Gallery and the Botanical Gardens. You can save money on hotels by booking in advance and staying further out of the city centre, but also browse the accommodation options on Airbnb and HostelWorlds.com. You should also look at hotels in Chinatown as this is a great location and hotel prices tend to be cheaper here. So now let's look at the best things to do. Of course, the most popular thing to do in Kuala Lumpur is to see the Petronas Towers. These are an iconic landmark in the city and should be visited during your first time here. Learn more about the country at the National Museum and get shopping at Central Market. There are plenty of stunning temples to visit whilst you are in the city, but you should also try the local flavours here too. We recommend sticking to the local restaurants to enjoy the best food the city has to offer. The Kuala Lumpur Bird Park is a unique garden to visit with over 3,000 species of birds, whilst families can enjoy the Sunway Lagoon theme park. Take in amazing views from Kuala Lumpur Tower and get lost in Chinatown. Once you have seen the many sights in the city, make sure to take a day trip out to Batu Caves. This is a series of caves and is one of the most popular sites in the country. And inside you can find cave temples and Hindu shrines. Watch this video to find out 10 reasons to visit Kuala Lumpur. Then to learn how to save money in Malaysia, watch this video. We hope you have a fantastic time and stay creative.